Chandler Market Player. All right, what we got? Um, oh, Akio. Wait, did I say 325? All right, boys. So we got some new PP rules today for JP. Um, honestly, I've been really enjoying these PP rules. They seem like they've been more focused towards like debuff teams and debuff units, which are super fun. I can't lie, really fun. Um, this week rule is gonna be pretty much um whenever you get attacked, you gain 10% of attack. Um, and you also got the season rule where um if the unit has a debuff on it they'll take 30 percent more damage so you gotta be very careful whenever you attack because you can end up giving your your opponent like a insane amount of attack and it limits up to 10 times so you can give them 100 percent additional attack which means they're gonna have like bro it's gonna be insane it's gonna have it's gonna be double attack so you want to be very very careful if, on when how you attack which is why we're gonna be using this team now i wanted to use chandler just because of the fact that i feel like um i want to stop people from attacking me just because I know I'm hitting with the counter card and then they'll take a lot more damage just because they build up my attack. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Um, you already know what to say, boys, in the comments. Okay, okay. And let's get into it, boys. All right. We got Tarmiel with Margaret. My favorite, boys. My favorite, of course. Yes. Um, Not much I can do. But like push from ultimate against this guy. Actually, I'm probably gonna just be aggressive, honestly, and just nuke his Margaret right here. I might as well just be super aggressive. And he's evade food. Of course he's evade food, bro. All right. All right. Let's see what he got now. Then somehow he's evade food now. I didn't know that was a meta. And he goes for regular silver cards. Dude, Lily just did all that just to get nuked afterwards. All right. Cause he he has to debuff me somehow, some way. Man just did all that for nothing. Yep, forfeits. He literally just did that for nothing. All right. Well, GG. Okay, so what we have here? Oh my god, holy relic. Askinor. 328 I'll CC me. Holy. Um The only I'll CC Chandler though is Askinor. I'm assuming he might be attacked then. Yeah, he just spams. He's gonna probably go for Chandler right here. Yep, he does. He literally goes for Chandler this entire time. Oh man. Alright. He just instantly go for Chandler. All right. Um, I don't know what I can do now. Cause he's gonna, he's just gonna target me. Um, the entire time. All right. I was not expecting this. He must have like Goddess Elizabeth or Zell just in the back. Cause what do I do after this? All I have is like Zeldris. I need a Chandler for the stance. And I wish I LCC this dude. Cause I need a Chandler for the stance card. Cause now he's gonna just um target my Chandler, get rid of him. Then I'm done for. Oh, right, he goes for Merlin. Why? Why? Wait, why would you do that? Oh, he already had an AOE. Yeah, because I can't target him. But Chandler had most of my cards, so I guess it's good for me. Cause then I could just maybe get rid of um his Merlin. Like Lily. Um Yeah. I'm assuming he has like Zelda's in the back though. So I'm very curious on how much damage I'm um I'm gonna have left. Oh man, I should have attacked Escanor. and made sure that his Merlin would be like low HP or something like that. That probably wouldn't be my best option. No, he has Gother in the back. Okay. Why do you come out like that? Yep, he has Ludosio to kill me off too. Oh man, yep. Very unfortunate for me. 
too that holy relic bro oh man this sucks all right let's make sure he has no other options then should have just went hard all hard on like um Eskinor, seems like it not like he really had anything he's probably gonna go aggressive again against me um what we could do is probably stop his silver cards then oh never mind we can't do anything yeah he locks he locks me right there um and probably just do this then it looks like he's attack yeah he's definitely attack right now which is why he can't really do that much damage against us i hope he takes away my gauge too just so i can get it right back i hope so this man was holy relic asknor and we caught up we got a good old comeback oh he took away my ultimate that sucks okay that sucks right there now all right that sucks all right so we're gonna have to just do this then Hopefully, I kill right here by critting. All right, so let's see what his Gotha can do. He can't really do that much damage. I mean, he can delete my cards. He's like 6006, which I'm assuming he was. Because he freaking out CC me. Or, or was he like based more on his Holy Relic? Yeah, he was 6006. But it doesn't matter because we already have our ultimate ready. So all I have to do is just seal his hand of silver cards and we end up just winning. GG, my dude. Um, you should have like Purgatory Bond in the back. Uh, that's what the most common people use in the back is like Purgatory Bond. Just because, you know, most people are running like Gothers and Lolly Merlins. So GG, my dude. Took a hard L. And you went first, if I'm not mistaken. Oh yeah, you can take my gauge. I almost forgot about that. That's right. It's already GG anyways. See ya. Bye bye. What a close match. That was such a close match, man. Man, it's always fun when you play um during resets. You get all the whales. Oh my god, it's the same person from before. Oh man, it's the same guy. Alright, he's gonna target Chandler this entire match. Or he's gonna go after my go through. Let's see. Does he repeat his defeat again or does he do something different? I'm very curious on what he does this time. I think he might do the same thing. Or he goes after Chandler. Yep, he does. He does actually do the same thing. Alright. Oh man, but he nukes this time. What did he do last time? Did he kill? Did he kill? No, I think he probably targeted me or something last time. All right, so I might have to do something like this where I go after Eskin right here. Just lower his HP from his flood damage card. And then I have my ultimate ready. So we lower his HP. Just make sure his flood damage is weaker now. Um, And then we probably going to ult right here. Man, I feel so bad about this guy. I already feel like he has like no Lolly Merlin cards, really. That are Oh, that is a power strike, okay. But your HP is too low. Cause you use HP slash defense. So you can't do that much damage. Yep. Told you, man. And this is gonna hurt a lot. <laughs> Once I start to debuff you, this this is gonna hurt. Came and lie came and lie to you, my guy. This is gonna hurt. Probably target you. So see it, my dude. <laughs> Enjoy this ult. Ow. Ouch. That, that, I know that gotta hurt. This man's like, I'm tired of this YouTuber. He keeps getting me. My holy relic not working. What's wrong with the ignore 30% defense holy relic Eskinor? <laughs> this is why Eskinor holy relic is just like so trash, man. All it is is just a CC thing. Like all you do is ignore 30% of the, your defense. I mean, other defense. And you instantly just lose. 
like it's just bad it does nothing for you it's just a cc thing right now same dude okay no it's not it's somebody different cool i don't know what that guy was doing last time um all right we just gonna abuse him then um for the entire match let's go all right i'm just troll him oh i should have debuffed them's gother for the memes bruh i should have debuffed gother for the memes now that I thought about now that I thought about it, I should have debuffed Gotha for the memes. Cause right now I'm trying to go for Gotha Ultimate right now. Oh my god, and I would get like a whole handful of like Lolly Merlin cards. Did he literally just go for his ultimate on me? What is going on? Oh man, I just realized I can't even stop it now because I wasted that card. Wow. Um, very interesting right now. Kind of interesting turn of events now. Um, what do I do? How do I beat this guy? I think he's dead right here, honestly. Yeah, he's dead. What was I worried about? I forgot I was a YouTuber, so, you know, I kind of like went automatically. Yeah, GG. I don't know why he pushed for his ultimate. He should have played regular. But I'll take the W. Chandler Market Player. 333. So he has the one that's going to back probably with a Holy Relic. Um, If he doesn't have a gold buff, he's probably going to just debuff me with Chandler right here on my Gother. And that's going to be fun to deal with. Let's see. Will he start with gold buff or he's going to go for... um. A debuff with Chandler on my Gother. Instead. He could do that. Yep, he does that. Debuffs me. and probably going to throw up a stance right here. Okay, I'm not liking that hand. From his Margaret. So, I'm probably going to just do something like this then. Um, and hit him with the Infect. It doesn't really matter to me. I just wanted to do some damage real quick. He's gonna debuff me with Gotha now. Which is why I threw up the stance counter. Just in case he wanted to attack me. Cause he's gonna take a lot of damage from this. Alright, he cleanses. Dude, you're gonna take a lot. You're gonna take a lot from the stance hit. Came a lot of you. It's gonna hurt. Told him, man, it was gonna hurt. That hurt me. So I'm probably gonna just end up doing this to this guy. Um, I'm looking at my. Oh man, he's gonna. Actually, wait, you can't even do much. He can't do much against me now. All right, so we locking him up. You better hope you have multiple Chandler cards, or you taking double ultimates. Actually, I'm just let you take both ultimate anyways. All right. You don't use a regular AOE. I'm very curious on what he's going to do right here. Because I, I might as well just spam my AOEs against this guy. Okay, debuffs. He's increasing my attack even more. Oh, man. Hopefully, he targets the right person. And he does. He is my lolly Merlin. Oh man, that sucks. I literally had nothing right there. Oh, that sucks, man. He actually does target the right person too. Yeah, I can't do nothing. I need a lolly Merlin to be alive right there too. But I couldn't get no HP back. Yep, and he's still alive. He has Eskinor in the back, too. Alright, so what can we do? Is he going to attack me again? Oh, man, he does. He just spams attack now because he got the attack boost again. 
Dude, that sucks, man. I couldn't get no HP back. Oh my god. I literally infected this dude and couldn't get no HP back. Yeah, yeah, that's gonna back. I know. All right, what we got? Um, oh, Keo. Wait, did I say 325? Or was that like on something when I saw that? Is this an attack purpose a bond or something? Oh my god, that said 396. Dude, what is this HP? Holy snap, dude. All right, I'm just targeting you then. I wonder if he's going if he's like the perfect eight bond player that likes to attack heavily. Cuz right now it seems like I have nothing. Cuz I have no blue units. So I have to see what he's going to do. All right, he buffs himself up. Oh, he does attack. All right. So he is aggressive. Yeah, he is aggressive. Well, I can't do much against that then. Um, might as well just throw my stance right here, since I can't do much. Hopefully, he doesn't have another stance, so I can take away his gauge. I think he might actually does have another stance, doesn't he? Yeah, he does. Which is very unfortunate for me. Does not have to deal with this. Um. Now that I think about it, I should make him lose his detonate effect with this. And just hit him with an infect. His detonate from his ult should be gone, right? I want that Kyo gone. But it looks like uh, Kyo is never going to be gone. The way my damage is set up. That's what it looked like. Kyo is never going to be gone. Oh, man. Look at that. He had a Silver Stance card, too. So he's going for Perks 8 Bond Ultimate right here. Yep, he's just going for Perks 8 Bond Ult. I definitely couldn't do nothing about this one. Cause he literally has birthday bond ultimate, so um unless I would have saved up my um debuff card. I really couldn't do nothing. And I wish I had the AoE, man. Oh man, that sucks for me. Yeah. I'm just gonna get nuked by Bond now. I can't even kill. Oh man, I was literally right there too. And he had a holy relic. He had a holy relic Arthur too. Oh my god, that sucks. Yup, this is just an unwinnable matchup. Yeah, holy relic Arthur too. Yeah, I couldn't do nothing. Once he got that silver stance, yeah, I, I can't I can't get through him. Cause I don't have like um a Merlin team. A uh, summer Merlin team. He spams that and here comes Kyo attack card. Was that man like 325 or something? I swear. I swear it said 325 or something. Bondage is disgusting. Yeah, it said 320. This man is 320k with Twiggo. Oh my god, dude. You know how well you got to be with this? Oh man, the same person. Oh my god. And I'll have no blue units. I have no blue units to beat this guy. If I'm not mistaken, last time he was aggressive against me. Um, But that was last time. I don't know what he could be. Um... I don't know. Let's do this. Let's troll. Let's switch it up. Maybe I, I cause maybe I need to just save up my um silver card on Gother. Maybe. Cause I need like double ultimates to get beat this guy. And then an infect at the end. That's literally what I need. Looking at this man's hand. 
All right, throws the stance. Maybe I could go for ultimate right here. All right, Kyo attacks me, so he's wasting cards to go for his ultimate. Um, probably do something like this and then throw my stance afterwards. Just, I'm gonna try that out. Um, hopefully he doesn't have a stance. So we're gonna go in the loop like last time. Yeah, he buffs himself up. I throw up the stance just so I can do some damage a little bit. Oh yeah, that's some sweet, sweet damage. I wish I had the infect. I could never pull that card. Um, so we're just gonna debuff him right here. Do this, and now we have ultimate. Like literally, if I get if I pull infects, that literally would save me so much in this match. It will save me so much trouble. Cause then I could just stop him from um healing back up. So maybe I might get an infect this time. Hopefully I do. And no, I don't get it. Um, all right. So now I have to hope to kill, I guess. Because once first aid bond gets ultimate, I'm just done for. All right, he takes the stance. I'm not stance, the counter. He takes the counter. And then he takes the counter again. So he's very, he's saving up for his, um, his ultimates, it seems. Mm. If, if I'm mistaken, last time this man had like Twiggo. Twiggo on the back, which I'm assuming is going to be the Holy Relic Twiggo. Uh, look at my hand. I don't even have ultimate, too. I have nothing to stop this man. Uh, I, I guess I can do this and then stop his, um, the effect. His rupture effect, maybe? Maybe that might save me. It all depends on if I can do some damage with this. Ah, oh, man. Doesn't even kill. Doesn't kill. And he's Holy Relic, too. So he got back to full HP. Dang. Yeah, that sucks. Dang. Yeah, I can't beat, no I can't beat this team. Is he 300k with like Twiggo? He just ults me. I don't know if it's gonna kill because I, I took away his effect, but I don't know. Birthday Bonk is still nuke. I, I, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, he's still nukes too. Even if I hit him with Chandler Card, he's still nukes regardless. I literally took away his skill effect and still wiped me off. Like, I would need Summer Merlin build to um, beat a Birthday Bonk player like this. But I'm running um, Lolly Merlin, which means I need like multiple ultimates in the infect. All right, so what we got here? Um, is this a troll? What kind of troll is that? Oh, it's a. Oh, it's green. Okay. Okay. Well, I got to be careful to get that Tarmio then. Um, why do I feel like I want to target Tarmio most of the time? Why? Why do I feel like it? I don't know. Um, it all depends, right? Let me target Tarmiel for fun. For funsies. But I feel like that man be an absolute threat for some reason. Oh, yeah. Let's do some serious damage. The only bad part about it is I need more infects whenever I do use it. Um, let's see what he's going to do. Now, oh man, because I don't have an infect, I can't really do much, can I? Especially since he throw him those stance. Yeah, we're gonna do this then. Take away his gauge and let's attack him again. All right, let's go for it. Come on, can we do some damage? Come on, I need one more. Oh, let's go. I wonder what he had in the back. Did he have a guilt thunder? Oh, he forfeits. Wow. He didn't want to let me see what he had in the back, too. Let me see. He did have a guilt thunder. All right. Well, I guess it's going to be the last match for today. Oh, man. That man was too Tarmio reliant, it seems.
Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys like and subscribe again. Um, I can't wait to like think of some comps for today or this week. PP rule. It seems pretty fun. Been seeing a lot of people running like the one Escanor and Margaret a lot though. And Perks A Bond still. Oh my god, that Perks A Bond giving me nightmares. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys like and subscribe again. This is Merly, and I'm out. Peace.